Roblox Investor Simulator Update. What you need to know. Hello, everyone. Once again, welcome to another exciting video on Roblox Investor Simulator. Today, we're diving into the latest updates that have come to this popular game. If you've been active on the Discord server for Oblivion, you've probably seen the recent announcements about some minor changes that have been made. Let's explore these updates, the implications for your in-game strategy, and how you can adapt to the changes. Overview of the latest updates. The recent update may not seem monumental, but it introduces several tweaks that could affect your gameplay. Here's a breakdown of what you can expect. Bug fixes. As always, the developers are keen on improving the player experience by addressing bugs and glitches. Although minor, these fixes can enhance your overall enjoyment of the game. New roof designs. Aesthetic changes have also been implemented, with new roof designs added for your properties. While these changes may not directly impact gameplay, they allow for greater customization and creativity in your investments. Gas station and car dealership upgrades. Two significant businesses, the gas station and car dealership, have received upgrades. These improvements can potentially enhance your profits if you manage them effectively. However, despite these upgrades, there are no new buildings added that can help you earn more money at this moment. This lack of new properties means you'll need to focus on optimizing your current investments. The nerf of businesses. A hard truth. Perhaps the most impactful change in this update is the nerf to businesses, which is something every player needs to take note of. Previously, players could earn about 2.3 billion in-game cash every 30 seconds. Now, that number has dropped significantly. Understanding the new earnings. Let's break down the new earnings system. Before the update, when you went to manage your advertising, the maximum for internet advertising was 10 billion, allowing you to manually input your desired amounts. Now, however, the maximum has been reduced to just 1 billion. Let's take a closer look at how this affects your profits using some examples. Purchasing supplies. For instance, if you want to invest in furniture, you will need to allocate a significant amount of your in-game cash. For every 1,000 units, you would typically need around 1 billion. Automated advertising. The new advertising system is automated, which means there is no longer an input area for manually adjusting your advertising budget. You can only click through to select options like newspaper ads, posters, and billboards. Breaking down the numbers. So, how does this all translate into actual earnings? Here's a scenario to illustrate. Expenses. After purchasing supplies, let's say your total expenses are now 1.2 billion. Income. With the new advertising setup, your income has dropped to around 1.4 billion every 30 seconds. Net profit. After calculating your expenses, you are left with only 200 million in profit every 30 seconds, a stark contrast to the previous 2.3 billion. Should you continue using raw art or bullseye? Given these new earning rates, many players are questioning whether it is still worthwhile to use businesses like raw art, bullseye, or Home Depot. If you're an active player and can keep up with the grind, 200 million every 30 seconds might still be acceptable. However, for those who prefer passive income strategies, this nerf could make these options less attractive. Strategies moving forward. With these changes in mind, what should you do next? Focus on high-yield investments. Prioritize businesses that have shown consistent returns and are less affected by the nerfs. Diversify your portfolio. Consider branching out into other areas of the game that might offer better returns without relying solely on businesses impacted by the nerf. Stay updated. Keep an eye on updates from the developers. They often make adjustments based on player feedback, which could lead to new opportunities in the future. Final thoughts. While the latest update in Roblox Investor Simulator has introduced some changes that may be disappointing, it also offers a chance to re-evaluate your strategy and adapt. Remember, every game has its ups and downs, 
and staying flexible is key to success. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more updates and strategies. Thank you for tuning in, and happy investing in Roblox Investor Simulator.